Yesterday, Dignity Health alerted by employees by email and staff about a hospital doctor who said, was said to have made credible threats against the staff. Now, today, that doctor is speaking out about the allegations and a lawsuit that he has filed against Dignity Health. CBS 13's Kelly Ryan sat down with Dr. Strasnicki and his attorney. The doctor calls himself a medical whistleblower who has been wrongly accused, his character assassinated. I worked there for Dr. Martin Strasnicki says he learned from a colleague yesterday that Strasnicki's face was posted in a number of Dignity Hospitals calling the doctor a quote credible threat and saying Strasnicki was a person of interest to the FBI. Dr. Strasnicki says he was never being sought by the FBI. Strasnicki says his attorney was calling the FBI when the doctor got a call from an FBI agent. He asked me a few very quick questions. Had I made any threats? I said, absolutely not. Strasnicki stands by what he says is his stellar record of 16 years of medical practice, including anesthesiology. My entire career, I've never so much as thrown a paper clip at a nurse, a tech, another doctor, or anything. I haven't threatened anybody. Strasnicki also talked about a lawsuit he filed in February against Dignity Health, outlying a number of incidents and issues starting in January of 2013, three months after the doctor started working at Dignity Health. They had it in for me because of the complaints I was making about the patient care. The first incident in the lawsuit states, Dr. Strasnicki reported and complained about various issues in the hospital's operating room, including but not limited to lack of basic standard equipment. The lawsuit also says he was falsely accused of using the N-word during a dispute. It was uh, completely uh, uh, refuted. It was completely uh, unsubstantiated. Uh, it never happened. The lawsuit goes on to say that Strasnicki was subject to ongoing unwelcome sexual harassment at Methodist Hospital by a nurse. It's just so uncomfortable and it's just difficult to do your job. Strasnicki's suit states the repeated instances of unwelcome physical touching created a hostile working environment. Dr. Strasnicki says he spoke with that nurse and reported the harassment to hospital leadership on numerous occasions. The hospital responded to the lawsuit denying all allegations, saying the defendant took reasonable steps to prevent and correct workplace harassment. Plaintiff unreasonably failed to use the complaint procedure provided by defendant. Strasnicki's attorney says his lawsuit is about getting justice. This man needs to have his name restored. He needs to have his career restored, and he needs to get back to what he does the best. Now, Dr. Strasnicki is currently on administrative leave from Dignity Health.